down at the bottom. It's the same ones we saw yesterday. A little one and a big one. Try not to get it so shaky for you. There they go. sifting hole. This isn't the sifting hole, but there's pottery and stuff all the way down here. Walking up here. Just seeing there's a lot of glass. I got really bad poison ivy or oak or something yesterday. But it's too hot to wear pants in here. Still like 89 degrees. Yeah, it didn't really rain since we're gonna set our stuff here. To get the sifter and start sifting. How about it? We did pretty well yesterday. Excited to get started again. Alright, I dug a test pit and we're gonna sift it. Oh crap, I forgot to put my gloves on there in the bag. Yep, glass and iron. Pottery. All right, we'll get to it on the next. through it and get these roots out of here. A lot, a lot of, a lot of nails. Nails galore. Oh, that's a uh, chip off an arrowhead, I believe. Maybe. Okay, some zinc. Or lead, actually. That feels like lead that was on zinc. Here's some more lead. Lead or pewter, something like that. Big iron spikes. Some more lead. Huh. All right. Seen anything else just yet? Oh, here's a little screw. A little screw. Alright, that's it. Just throwing it in and I see another porcelain button. Or not porcelain button, seashell button. It's exactly what it is. I'm gonna have to be very careful with it because these things are so incredibly fragile. I just set it right there for now. Could be a good layer. I don't see anything else just yet that I put in there. But we'll sift it here in a minute. That's good though. One more seashell button. Put it on our pile here. Check that bad boy out. 
That is a big old piece of copper. Huh. Copper that they like snipped. Not sure exactly what it was off of. Uh, what did I just see? We got a top. Bottle top. Embossed glass. Bone. That's somebody's old rib bone or something off of a stew. A little pebble, huh? That's weird. It's probably melted something. Huh, that's the bottom of a tiny little bottle. Is that copper? No, that's a nail with something on it. Interesting, a lot of brick. That is a cap slate, a slate right here. I don't see any other buttons or anything. That was a pretty good one. Nope, there's lead. Lead. Not a bad little scoop at all. And like I said, I've been through here so many times. And that big giant piece of copper right here, that should have screamed with a detector. So, that was pretty deep too. Start scratch. Oh boy. We got a marble. A nice little marble. More brick. It's the top of a, a uh, can. Medicine bottle. A little cap right there. Alright, that's all I'm seeing. Well, cool. We got a marble that time. Tons of iron, all oh, this iron everywhere. Iron, iron, iron. Bricks. Anything? Oh yeah. All right, we just got another, another, another sift box full and sifted it. And I see a couple things. Here's a brass copper piece, probably out of like a Model C Ford or something. Another coppery brass piece. Probably the same, probably off of a vehicle. Some bone just poked through here. Man, these mosquitoes are terrible. There's a little bit of bone. Huh. Tons of iron, big pieces of iron that I don't know what they are. A lot of glass again. Oh yeah, that was a pretty good one. Look, I really want to find like a pipe stem too, or a pipe. I think that's it on this one. I have a feeling a bottle or something's gonna come out soon. Really hope. Let me put this here. Ooh, and let me show you what I'm doing up here. Oh yeah. So much stuff, like I just poke it in, big old clumps of glass and stuff come popping out. So much stuff in here. It's ridiculous. So I'm just basically scooping it and putting it in the sifter. Thought I felt something around. Maybe it was that rock. Oh well, we'll find out when we sift it. But yeah, still going, the artifact layer. Can definitely feel more bricks and stuff in there, and more iron. A lot more stuff. It's just finding the good stuff with the bad. Well, it's not bad, it's all cool. But, it's desirable targets. Wow, digging a test pit. 
And look what's sitting right here on the road. Digging down, digging down, digging down. Right there, another seashell button. That is so cool. Still never found my clay marble from the other day. And I got a big one and a little one. I switched over slightly, but we still got a lot of stuff coming in here. A lot of iron and rocks and stuff. It's a piece of lead right here. It's a nail sticking through it. Um, I saw something shiny. Yeah, right here. There's like a lipstick tube or something. Nice little design. And I found one more porcelain button in the hole. Not porcelain, I keep saying porcelain. Seashell button. I'm gonna have to coat these in something, like a super glue or something, to, so they don't break. Oh, part of a hurdy cup, turpentine. That's a keeper. I don't see any more buttons or anything. Oh, there's something. What is that? I don't know, that might be leather. All right, on to the next. Well, this is all the sifting goodies for today. I got part of a cork top top. Whatever this thing is, I'm not sure. Um, man, the camera is fogging up again. We got a lead bottle top, something patent, bottom of a bottle, a bone, a marble, big piece of copper, three buttons, all seashell, a hurdy cup, um, some lead. This is pretty cool. This is like stove polish oil, but it's uh, all broken up. Piece of lead, a little lipstick tube of sorts. Lead or zinc, more melted lead, copper pipe wire, connection of sorts. Yep, that's the extent of it today. Not too shabby sifting. Oh, oh, I'm, we're, we're not done here yet today. But I'm going to make this video about sifting and we'll detect on the other part. Alright folks, thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next.